Packers hit the field for the first practice of training camp later this morning, things will look a lot different from what fans have been seeing for the past decade. The Matt LaFleur error gets kicked into high gear in his first year at the helm. Is there anything that has him concerned? Maybe the unknown, you know, you're going through this the first time and, you know, you, you, you try to prepare for every scenario that's that's going to come your way. How the coach and quarterback Aaron Rodgers interact will be scrutinized closely through the entire season and how quickly the offense adapts to LaFleur's offense will garner plenty of headlines. But don't forget about the monumental changes to the defense. Green Bay's all-time sack leader and most visible star other than Rodgers, Clay Matthews left for the Rams and the team released longtime defensive line standout Mike Daniels on Wednesday. The Packers are banking on their splashy free agent signings of Zadarius Smith, Preston Smith, and Adrian Amos, along with top rookies Rashawn Gary and Darnell Savage to turn the defense from a liability to a strength. I think obviously there's choices, you know, that you have to make. Um, some are more long-term, you know, choices that you have to make looking out forward. Um, we feel pretty good about the depth we have in our defensive line room right now. Um, and these things are never easy, but... Um, you know, we wanted to make sure we had some flexibility moving into, you know, the years ahead. But rest assured, Packers fans, not everything has changed. There will be kids, there will be bikes, and there will be players entirely too big trying to ride those bikes. Even in the topsy-turvy world of the NFL, there are some things that you can still count on. Delaney Bry, today's TMJ4. Always beautiful scene, 6.30.